So I'm going to add a baby's name to this little onesie. And I'm going to go right there. And what I want to do is measure from there to there with my measuring tape. I want to see how long it is to go from about right there to right there. And then I want to look at not only the length, but the width. I don't want it longer than half of my finger. And so let's get the measuring tape and see what we come up with. So with my measuring tape, I can see that if I go about right there, I want my design no longer than about six inch. And if I turn it, I don't want it any taller than two inches. And really that's an inch and a half. That's about far as we can go. Two inches is large. So I'm going to go down and let's say an inch and a half should be big enough. I'm in my silhouette screen. So when I look at my design and I have chosen, uh, let's see what the font is. The font is ABC Coach. And so I've chosen that font. And I'm going to look at my design. And so my design is about 5.9. That's wide enough. And I've got it at 1.9 as far as height. So I'm going to adjust the height because two inches looked like it was gonna be overwhelming. My measurements, you can see still at about 5.9 which is close to 6 and then I've got it 1.6 going here so now we need to mirror our design because when it prints on the paper we want to turn and flip it so we always have to mirror the design by going up to object hit mirror and then we want to flip it well, I'm trying to do this left-handed and record. That's not happening. Okay, now we can work. Let's go to mirror and flip here horizontally. And now we're ready to send our design. And we've got heat transfer smooth. And let's go ahead and print that. And then after it, this cuts out, not print but after it is cut then we'll press it so now that I have the letters cut out I'm just going to weed it by pulling this off and after I pull all of it off I'll go back and I'll take those parts out so that the O and the B will be clearer okay so I have cut out and weeded the baby's name and there we have it in place and we're just going to iron it down right there around the designs and voila so I'm using my Cricut mini press and I have it on the highest setting and I'm just using my Teflon sheet and ironing the baby's name down with a little light pressure. And then we'll be finished. So now that I've ironed the name on, here is the finished project for the baby. Is that not the cutest?